Whoa, a different guy. It's, it's just a whole different person who's not the head of the family anymore. He's put his time in. He's helping his son move up the ladder and you know, just having a good time. And then I play my brother, a brother of his is in jail. And they asked me to do that. It's a whole different thing. So that was fun. I had to lose a lot of weight, but that was fine. It was good. So two, two characters in one film. Yep. Any other uh, projects that right. you're excited about that you can tell us about? Any sneak peek? There, there's one called In With The Devil that Dennis Lehane wrote and producing it. It's a limited series for Apple. That, that was just great. It was just so much. It was just really good, fun work. Hard, but fun. And then I just finished a movie called Cocaine Bear, which is based on a true story about the plane with the, the dealer's plane was going down, and there was a certain area if that was to happen, he would throw the kilos where it went. Well, one one was in the woods, and it, it fell and it broke open, and the. <laughs> It's a funny, it's, so the, the bear sticks his nose in the cocaine and likes it. He goes off and he's doing his thing and whatever. There's a bunch of people like hiking or doing this, doing that. It, it was my drug, so I want to go get them. And it's just the wild, crazy story. It's nuts. Then I did this movie called Cocaine Bear that's based wow. on a true thing that happened. The, the, back in the 80s, there were these guys that would fly cocaine in from, from down south and, and what the plane was going down and, and what they had to do was they, they threw the, all the coke that they had in the plane over a certain area. And what happened is a bear came up and one of the kilos broke and he stuck his nose in it. And <laughs> it's just kind of nutty. But that that I think is going to be really good. And, and speaking of women, doing Elizabeth Banks directed it. She did. A, she was great to work with. Um, yeah, that's an odd one. That that's and I play the guy who uh, whose coke it is. Imagine that. Um, so that one's gonna that that's a different kind of movie too. <laughs> in, in terms of an ele elevator pitch, I don't think I've ever heard a better one in my life. Told ever. Ever, just a title. I'd go just to go cocaine bear. What the fudge? Ray Liotta has died. He was 67 years old. I don't have a strong, big desire to be like major, major personality. I just hope to get the opportunity to keep working and, you know, with some really interesting parts with some really great people. The actor's publicist confirmed his death, revealing that he died in his sleep in the Dominican Republic where he was shooting the film Dangerous Waters. I just stayed with it because I started getting, you know, better and better parts. And like anything, when you show, you know, people show you a little appreciation or that you did a good job, it makes you feel good. And, and I stayed. Leota, a New Jersey native, had a career that spanned more than 30 years. His first major acting role, Something Wild, which earned him his first Golden Globe nomination.